been a very, very long time. Probably since uh, we've had seismological instruments, we haven't seen such a such an event. In this region, I think the size, the magnitude of this earthquake was larger than might have been anticipated um, because we didn't have a history of such a large earthquake on the eastern Anatolian fault. As you know, earthquakes are caused ultimately by the motions of plate tectonics. So uh, we have the Anatolian region, the basically most of the, the, the land area of Turkey is squeezed in between two faults, the northern Anatolian fault and the eastern Anatolian. Africa is moving northward, Arabia is pushing in to the, to the west, or sorry, to the east. And um, so it builds up the motion of the plates. The plates move at a very slow rate, just centimeters per year, but they get stuck together along the fault lines. And so what happens is the fault is stuck and held together by friction, just like when you try to push a heavy piece of furniture, you know, at first it resists, it doesn't move. Um, that builds up the strain in the Earth's crust. And then when the earthquake happens, it releases all of that in one, you know, in one minute or something like that. So yes, the several meters of motion that happened because of this fault was actually the accumulated strain from uh, hundreds of years of plate tectonic motion. So a few centimeters per year adds up to meters. I can't think of another example with such large magnitude, 7.8 and 7.5 within less than 24 hours, even in the past um, one or 200 years. I think it's been a very, very long time, probably since uh, we've had seismological instruments, we haven't seen such a such an event. I should be clear. So I lived in Turkey when I was a child. I have not done research since I became a um, seismologist and geologist in Turkey, but I work on very large plate boundary faults. So the, the, the largest faults on the planet, um, like the subduction zones, like the San Andreas Fault. And um, I've paid attention to understanding the Anatolian fault systems as well. Um, maybe someday also uh, I'll have a chance to contribute some scientific work uh, in Turkey.